you guys, I'm Suzanne Bowen and I'm here in Nashville, Tennessee. Downtown is behind me and I've got a great four part upper body workout for you that you can do anytime, anywhere, outside, anywhere that has a bench. Now you're going to need a stopwatch, so I'm using my iPhone for that. And I want you to make sure that you're warm before you do these strength moves. So to get started, you're going to take your arms down in a push-up position. So what I love about an incline push-up is that if you're new to push-ups or you're not maybe not quite as strong, you're elevated so your body is on an incline. So you're, it's not as hard as if you were straight down on the, on the ground. So I can go with that extended leg. But then for some of you that need more of a challenge, you're going to lift the leg up to you really connect your core in and you don't let anything change. And then you'll bend your elbows out and up. And you'll feel the whole front body working here. And you go inhale to lower, exhale to rise. Now you're gonna do 30 seconds with each leg extended for one minute total of these push-ups. So you can totally keep your arm your legs down. And you may not even be able to go down as low. I want you to keep good form. So form is first. And then the second exercise is going to target this lat area, this bra bulge area that I'm always interested in targeting. And it's really effective, so I want you to have your hands closer together, so just shoulder width apart, and you'll step back, and you'll make sure your legs are hips distance and parallel. And then from there, you'll drop your heels to the back, and then lift this arm up, and then if you can, I want you to try to reach over and really strengthen that lower back area, and then press up. And you'll do this for 30 seconds. And then you'll switch sides, going to the other side and do that for 30 seconds. The third exercise is a dip. So we're going to target the back of the arms. So we'll come, I'll come in on this side. You'll bring your hands underneath your shoulders. So your fingertips will be off of the bench, but it's important that you step your feet out so that your hips are just brushing the bench. And I want your, instead of tucking your hips under here, I want your spine to be neutral. And then you just brush down, bending those elbows straight down and up. And you, the closer you get your hips to the bench, the more in the back of the arm that you'll be, which is good. And you're also less likely to, you know, put pressure on that front shoulder. You need to make sure that you've got your form correct. And you could either, either hold or you could bend down and up for one minute. The last exercise is an incline plank. So it's a full arm incline plank. And it's going to be with the feet up on the bench. Now, if you cannot do this, you can always just keep your feet down on the ground on one level or you can turn around and I'll show you the modification. Let me show you the exercise first. So take your legs on the bench and walk out and then hold your legs up just like this and you'll have your stopwatch and you'll have one minute here really pressing up. Now if you want more of a challenge you could lift the leg for 30 seconds and then lift the other leg. To make it easier you can just do the same plank this way have less weight on your arms you'll be in that incline that's it you'll do that four that's about four minutes you could do it two to three you could do one to three times through and then I want you to end with some stretches so all you do is take your arms back behind you and open your chest and then you'll, you'll hold that for about 30 seconds about three breaths deeply three to four to five breaths and then take your hand between your shoulders and then once you have your triceps stretch, you'll lean over and then you can pull that arm across to get the back shoulder. And then you'll do the same stretch on the other side. So once you get your triceps stretching from that dip and you lean over, you'll get the lats and then you'll bring your arm across. And that's it. That's your routine. All you need is the bench and a stopwatch and you're good. I think that's pretty strong. I'll see you soon. Bye.